Now, uh, I mean, any other, you know, areas that, that you're not feeling what's going on? Any other areas that you think, you know, you'd like to do some things different? You know, kind of let me know where your head is at. That means grind. I agree. That's it, you know, I mean, grind each other. Ever since the first time we recorded. And I think us, you know what I'm saying, ourselves, because you know what I'm saying, we, we just can't go through this, you know what I'm saying, criticizing everybody else without looking at ourselves. Right. You know, I think, I think, you know what I'm saying, us, I think we need to be more, more, more active too. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I like, we shouldn't just sit back in and, and, you know what I'm saying, depend on these other people. I think, I think we, we should be getting more active. And I'm not saying that we're not active now, but I think, I think that, you know, because it all starts with us. Right. So I think that, that we should be more active vocally, you know what I'm saying, um, physically, like you said, with the grinding. That's what you're saying, take matters home. Yeah, you could not. So that way, you know, if it's... It, I'm just going to say something. <laughs> you just said something about the money. But I'm going to say it anyway. So that way, if it doesn't work out, then it's on us. You know what I'm saying? We can't look at it like, man, you know what I'm saying? If we wasn't fucking with them, then maybe we could have did it. You know what I'm saying? So I just think that, that we should take a lot of matters into our own hands. Because we're, we're independent as it is. Alright, well look, I'm gonna share with y'all I'm gonna share with y'all the views I've been having lately. This is the reason why I wanted to sit down and meet with y'all today. First one covered is going back to the topic of of, you know, the promotion. You know, the show promotion. Um I'm not gonna cut ties with anybody that we're dealing with right this second. I'm gonna, you know, you know, keep praying that, that they come through and see things the way we see them. In the meantime, I've already made up my mind that I'm getting ready to take over your promotion. You know, I, I'm getting ready to take that over. Uh, so y'all can put that in my hands. You know, uh, I'm getting ready to start working y'all some shows. I'm getting ready to start working y'all, you know, some public appearances. Start working y'all, you know, some fan interaction. Um, I'm gonna start doing a lot of a lot of your promotion myself because as a company. I've gotten real impatient with sitting back waiting on other people. It's really starting to get to me. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I tried not to put too much on my plate in the beginning. I said, okay, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to line up everything that DCT needs to take care of. You see what I'm saying? And I'm going to outsource some of the work that I'm not responsible for. But in outsourcing that work, I've noticed that these people don't have, you know, the, the, the passion for the company that I have, and they don't have the belief in the product that I have. You see what I'm saying? So I, I'm I'm tired of messing with people, man. From now on, I'll do it myself. You know what I mean? So I want y'all to understand that with these shows, because I'm not, you know, a major industry promoter. You see what I'm saying? Um, some of these shows will be, you know, smaller venues. Some of these shows will be nightclub performances. Some of these shows will be open mic performances. Some of these shows will be private, you know, private, you know, uh, 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 entertainment groups, you know, things like that. So a lot of these shows, man, when we first get out here on the ground, you know what I'm saying, are going to be pro bono shows, which means BCT is going to eat a lot of this damn cost. The travel expenses, the food expenses, the stay expenses, things like that. I'm willing to do that because I'm ready to start getting y'all the facial exposure time that you need. You know what I'm saying? But y'all have to also understand that there's going to be times where you're going to get out here and you're going to be doing shows, man. And you might, you know, have to do two shows a night, three shows a night. You might have to do this, that, or the other. And people, at the end of the night, you're going to be saying, man, you know what I'm saying? You get back to the house and be like, I didn't even get an outfit out of that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But these are some of the sacrifices that you got to be prepared for. At least look at it this way. While you guys aren't making any money yet, I'm steady spending money. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? So you could be in my shoes. <laughs> you feel what I mean? So, um, 
but there's going to come a time once we get out here and we start getting the different shows and you're doing the pro bono work and you're doing the grinding, you get to certain locations and you kill the show. And, the, you know, the people in the audience are like, you know, who was that and when are they coming back? You see what I'm saying? And the next thing you know, you got different nightclub spots and stuff like that all over the country that are calling you saying, hey, can we get Dark Side back out here? You know what I'm saying? And that's the time when you get paid for them. You, you understand what I'm saying? So you got you to gotta, you gotta put in the grind first. But it's coming. You know, I'm ready for it. Um, so, putting in that grind forever, though. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, I just, I just want y'all to know that that's, that's pretty much how it's going to be in the beginning. You know, I'm like y'all. I'm fed up with everybody else. So I, I'm getting ready to put it on my back. But with that being said, y'all got to cut me some slack. You feel what I'm saying? You know, we've got a gang of fans, man. You know what I'm saying? The problem is, a lot of people nowadays aren't motivated to actually go in and express the support. Join the you see what I'm saying? They listen, but they're not, they don't become involved in what you're trying to do. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, you see, we do it now, man. Yeah, yeah. We have to get them involved. And if we can't get them involved, then we, 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 we get them involved ourselves. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. But we got to get it moving. That's the one area where I need y'all to be a little bit more active is, is with the fan base. You need to start pushing the fan base. Um, I know you guys do it all the time anyway. You listen to beats, you listen to tracks, you grind, you make a, you know, come up with different songs and stuff like that. But I need you to get even sicker than what you have, man, with the grind. Because you're right, we do need to, we do need to record more than what we have there lately. Yeah. Um, part of that is my fault. You know what I mean? Because, you know, at the same time, I work, too. You know what I mean? And I still have to come home and do the, the family thing. You know what I mean? But that's no excuse. This is a business. You feel what I'm saying? So that needs to be corrected by me. You know? And I apologize to y'all for that, and, I, and, and we'll get it on track. Um, but that's the reason why I need you to get back on your grind more. Your creativity has got to get expanded. You know what I'm saying? Your... your, your you got you got to take it to that next level again. And you've already done that twice. You know what I mean? But now it's time to go to another level. You see what I'm saying? Because I want to start recording on a steady basis. One of my plans is in the meantime, while we're waiting to put together the album, start working on the solo mixtapes. I want to release, I, I want to start working on a mixtape series where it's not going to actually be full mixtape albums. You see what I'm saying? I want to start working on a series of singles. I want to start releasing uh, a new single um, every other day. If I can't release one every other day, we're going to release at least one new single every week <coughs> at a minimal. You see what I'm saying? Um, there'll be mixtape singles. But I want to start, you know, uh, putting more out there for the fans to reach out to. You know, that's all a part of us getting the fans involved, you know, is just to keep feeding them, you know, and, and let them eat. So y'all may get burnt out because either after a while, you know, releasing one new single every week and that, that comes up with the creation time, that's the recording time, that's the mastering time, that's the, you know, all that stuff all has to be done within one week with everything else that we're doing. That means y'all got to be on the grind. But that's my goal. Is to, I, I want to start working on this, this series of mixtape singles. Um, that's one thing that I'm working on. Now, I have a, a order of business that I want to tell y'all about that I saved until today. You see what I'm saying? Um, I have, I guess, a bit of good news, a bit of even better news, and a bit of bad news. Um, bad news first. We got pushed again. And we have to understand, me and you talked about that before, we have to understand with us not having a bunch of money or with us not being big name artists and things like that, it's going to happen. We're going to get pushed. we got a lot of people that are in it not for the music. they in it for the money. You feel what I'm saying? And any time somebody comes along that can offer them 50 cent more than what we can offer them, they're going to jump at it. I really was looking forward to what we were doing because it wasn't coming out of my pocket financially. I really can't afford that big ticket. But 
with all the things that I have planned for us, I can't afford not to have that big team. You see what I'm saying? So, I guess the, uh, the like I said, the bad news is we got fun. The good news is we still doing the motherfucker. You know what I mean? That ain't that ain't held nothing up. If anything, when we go in, when I schedule this session, and we go in and we do this jump, man, and we get this single release, y'all kill this motherfucker, man. I mean, for real. Just out of spite, just like, look what you missed. You know what I'm saying? Y'all get in there and kill this bitch. You know, give them something to feel bad about. I plan to kill me. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. So... <laughs> It's not negative, you know, it's a speed bump. But, like I said, first thing Monday morning, I promise y'all I get on the grind, I get the session set up, and still before the end of this month, we'll have that something done. This year is going to be big for us, man. I got a lot of plans, and unfortunately, I thought that a lot of people would help us reach those plans. We see now that we can't count on nobody but us, man. You know what I'm saying? So, you know. They got static, they got flow. You know what I'm saying? You know, all I gotta, you know, make sure, you know, flow and static got back. You see what I'm saying? And let's stay together. The three of us, man, fuck every outside source. If they're not willing to go in 150%, fuck them. Let's go. You know, with or without you, we gotta do it. Like I said, let's, let's change our mentality, man. Let's change our mentality. Fuck everybody. If their name ain't fake. If their name ain't static, if their name ain't Mr. Flow, if they don't represent Dark Side Music or Dream Come True Music, entertain it, man, motherfucker. Let's go. Yeah. Sounds good to me, man. Society's my fuckers anyway. So, with that being said, man, I got y'all. Y'all got me. 2011, nigga. You know what I'm saying? This time next year, we ain't gonna be sitting here, you know what I'm saying, having the same conversation. If we are, it's going to be our fault. I don't want to blame nobody no more. You feel what I'm saying? If we sit here having the same conversation this time next year, it's going to be our fault, man. Because we didn't take charge of it like we were supposed to.